And back here at home tonight, a sobering warning about the fight against cancer around the world. Today, the World Health Organization sounded the alarm, predicting that in the next 20 years, the number of people diagnosed with cancer will skyrocket from 14 million to 22 million. And so will the number of deaths, up to 13 million. And the number one killer around the globe will be lung cancer. And now ABC's Lindsay Janice has a new strategy here at home to keep some of the youngest Americans from ever getting hooked. Pack of cigarettes. The new ads aim to shock some sense into teens. You need a little more, honey. What happens next? Too disturbing to show. The girl peels off a piece of her skin. That damage? The real price of smoking. Pack of benthos. The cost of a pack of cigarettes for this boy? It's not enough. A tooth. The message crystal clear. The FDA appealing to teenage vanity in this new campaign by showing how smoking hurts your looks. People as young as 20 years old, they start to see fine lines, pigmentation, coarseness of the skin, and wrinkles around the mouth. The aging effects of smoking have long been studied. Look at these identical twins. The woman on the right, a non-smoker. Her twin on the left, a smoker. And look closely at their eyes. Here is the non-smoker. And here, the smoker. See her more pronounced bags and wrinkles? Experts say every day, 3,200 teenagers smoke their first cigarette. And the stark images in these ads may be the most effective way to make them quit. Getting at those new smokers is key. 90% of adult smokers took their first puff by age 18. See you again. And that's the ugly truth. Lindsay Janice, ABC News, New York.